Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you once again for stopping by. Today we're looking at SML Movie Night Swim by SML. Uh, posted, what, 10 hours ago? Not seen this one. Haven't checked out an SML in a few days now. They have posted a few, but this one just popped up. Thought it looks interesting. Something to do with Halloween theme, I'm sure. Anyway, go over to SML, drop a like and a sub and chat. We're trying to hit 750,000 subscribers. So subscribe will help, really help the channel grow. Let's get into the reaction. Guys, are you ready to eat food? What? <laughs> he just started playing a second. Did he say, guys, are you ready to eat poo? I think he said food. I thought he said poo. Anyway. So, guys, are you ready to eat food? Oh, yeah, dude. Who does that? Who says, so, guys, are you ready to eat food before they I eat food? I thought he said poo, People like, just twice. eat food when they're ready to eat food. Sonic. You actually told us we couldn't eat until you set up all the food and said, so, guys, are you ready to eat food? I don't know, Cody. I just wanted to narrate it in case someone's watching. I haven't ate yet. This looks delicious. It really does. Are those cheese sticks? Yes. Who could possibly they, be what, watching it's us? It's called eat? the corn dog. Come on, come on, go ahead and eat. I don't think anyone's watching us eat, Cody. I just like <laughs> to talk before I do stuff. Shut up. Junior, do you really need a quadruple cheeseburger with bacon? Do you really need to wear glasses? Well, yes, actually. A doctor told me I have to wear these. Well, a doctor told me I need to eat this quadruple cheeseburger. I highly doubt that. Actually, I bet a doctor would tell you not to eat that. Well, do you really need six corn dogs? Okay, listen. So how many holes dogs. does the male human body have? Not six. Oh, yeah? Count with me. Two ear holes, two nose holes, a mouth, and... Ew, oh. Yeah, exactly. Only one of these is for eating. Okay, let's just hurry up and eat, guys, so we can do other stuff. Okay. Tater touch. Oh, I'm so full. Me too. The real question is, is did they actually eat the food? Not the puppets, obviously, but the people behind there? Or did they just throw it away? Ew. Dude, too many tater tots. Because when you're hungry... I that better not have gone to waste. Quadruple cheeseburger. My ass. Oh. You guys want to go swimming? Is he going to stick with his ass? Junior, it's dark outside. My pool He's is gonna lit stick up, with Cody. Dude, it's October. Well, we never went swimming one time during the summertime. So I want to swim before it gets too cold outside. So come on, guys. Okay. Junior's being pretty good. So gay. easily convinced to go to night swimming, right? Off so he can see my abs. Yeah, that sounds like Junior. Cowabunga! Yeah, I love swinging the pool. Come on, Cody, get in. No, I should probably wait 30 minutes so I don't get a tummy cramp. Is he actually shredded? Yeah, Cody, that's just a myth. He you don't have to got wait 30 minutes to be eating to swim. But guys, my tummy, I don't want it to cramp. You're such a crybaby, Cody. Dude, get in. The water's fine. Wait, Joseph, you okay? Well, Junior, I think Joseph's drowning. Joseph's not drowning. I think he is. Wait, Joseph? 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 I, I don't see him. I don't see his body anywhere. Well, it is nighttime, and he is... Black. Junior, he has to be around here somewhere. <laughs> look for him. Okay, I'll look. Joseph! Okay. Joseph! Joseph, funny. are you in here, buddy? Joseph? I, I literally don't see him. L let me get out of the pool and let's go get Chef Pee-Pee to help. Okay, good idea. <laughs> Junior, what are you doing? Just get out. <laughs> I, I can't get out of the pool. But what do you mean you can't get out? Just pull yourself up. I physically cannot get out of the pool. Junior, it's not the fucking Sims. You don't need a ladder. Just pull yourself out of the pool. Look, I'll try. <laughs> Ugh, I just can't get myself up. Well, maybe you shouldn't have had a quadruple cheeseburger with bacon. Well, it's not the oh, cheeseburger. Oh, so you don't go swimming fully clothed. Oh, right, that shit's giving you heavy, you're bro. You're having a tummy cramp because you're wet. wet. No, no, that's not it, Cody. Grab my arm. Okay, fine. Grab my arm. Oh, Jesus, Junior, you're heavy as fuck. Maybe you shouldn't have had that quadruple cheeseburger with bacon. It's not the cheeseburger. The pool won't let me. The pool won't let me go. Call the cops. The cops? What are they the going to do? Won't let me go, bro. It's the pool won't let me go. You asked for this shit. Something's pulling me in the pool. It won't let me go. Where's this green light coming from? You see the uh, green oh, glow? Let go of me. Let go of me, pool. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm guessing that's where it's coming from. Hey, Holy shit. The cops? Yes, officer, there's a monster in the pool. And he won't let he's me leave. He's not expecting there's that. There's a monster in the pool. I don't see any monsters. No, he's in the pool. He won't let me leave. See, look, I, I can't get out of the pool. You know, this reminds me of a time I refused to get out of a pool. You refused to get out of a pool? Yeah, let me tell you about it. So when I was in high school, I okay, was on the swim team, okay. the girls swim team. See, I wasn't fast enough to be on the boys team, so I went up against the girls and I would still come in fourth place. But I swam slow for other reasons. Anyway, <laughs> one day I was in a race and I actually wanted to win this one. I swam so fast my swim trunks came off and I couldn't find them. Then all the girls got out of the pool and the coach said, Guy, come on out. And I said, no. And he said, Guy, get your ass out of the pool. It's time for the boys to swim. But I didn't want to get out. I didn't want the girls' swim team to see my small, shriveled-up package. So I was trying to yeah, think of a way to distract me then? everybody. That? And that's when I saw Pulls the Fire Alarm Paul. He was a kid that would pull the fire alarm if you dared him to. Paul the so I fire said, alarm hey, Paul, Paul, can you pull the fire alarm? And he said, 
Yep. So Paul pulled the fire alarm and everyone started running outside. So I said, now's my chance. But then two firefighters came and they pulled me out of the pool and took me outside with everyone else. And the whole school saw my little shriveled up shrimp. It was the most embarrassing day of my life. That and does after sound that, pretty none of the girls in school wanted to date me because they didn't want to be known for dating the guy with the tiny little shriveled up wiener. Everybody thought I had the tiniest wiener in school. Well, that was until Tiny Wiener Timmy transferred to our school. But that's a different story we can't animate. We could barely <laughs> even animate Wiener this Timmy. one. Boy, that's a really sad story, but I really cannot get out of this pool. Well, listen, kid, if you lost your swim trunks, I can go get you a towel so nobody has to see your Tiny Wiener. No, I have my swimming trunks on. Look. Oh, wow. It's got to be really tiny if you still don't want to get out, even though you're wearing swim trunks. No, listen, the pool will not let me out. And look, my friend Joseph, he's missing. Oh, what's he look like? He's black. Oh, well, you know, I mean, he was trying to swim, and I've heard things about, you know, People trying to swim when they're black. I don't know. It's a, it's a thing that people say. I don't know. Well, listen, yeah, I, I have not seen him since he's gotten in the pool. Oh, well, you know, it is dark outside, so maybe we just can't see him right now. That's what I thought. But listen, can you just help me get out of the pool? <laughs> yeah, let's pull you out. Ugh. Well, that was really Wait, easy. How'd you do that? I just used my hands and my strength. Well, no, no, I, I kept trying to get out, and I, I couldn't get out. You just saved me. The green light's yeah, got okay. as well. Okay, well, I suggest you stay away from this pool because you clearly don't know how it works. Well, no, no, there's a monster with a face. It, it was trying to, it was trying to eat me. I think it wouldn't let me get out. Okay, yeah. Well, I guess I'm a hero then. Maybe they'll give me a medal for this. That face is actually pretty <sighs> scary. I'm not getting this pool ever again. Ugh, 1015. Ugh, 1016. Ugh, 1017. <sighs> Cody, Cody, Cody! Oh, sorry, Junior. You just caught me working off those corn dogs. No, listen. There's a monster in my pool. No, there's not, Junior, you fucking idiot. No, there's, seriously, there's a monster in the pool. It grabbed my leg. It wouldn't let me go. Then how'd you get out? The cop got him to let me go. So the monster listens to cops? I don't know, but there's a monster in my pool. What do we do? Well, I guess if there's a monster in your pool, you should just not go in the pool. Huh. I mean, if I don't go in the pool, it you took your friend, me. bro. Yeah, exactly. Like, huh. you don't yeah, even need to die. See, well, this is probably if, he's still, if he's still in the pool, he's probably he's dead by now. Just, Nobody just can hold the breath pool. that yeah, long. That easy. But I really love Not even pool. I, mean, I never can go in it ever again. Well, apparently you didn't really use your pool very often anyway. I mean, you literally just said that you haven't used it all summer, and apparently that monster's been living there for a while, and you didn't even notice. So I guess he could live there. I guess you're right. Junior, Cody, you hear that? No. It's Joseph! He's still alive! Joseph, I'm That's coming his soul, you. bro. Junior, are you okay? I don't hear anything. Junior, <gasps> Joseph? Joseph, I'm right here. Where, where are you, Joseph? I, I don't see you. Okay, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> come in the pool and Bro. I'm gonna save you. I know there's a monster in there, but I, I'm gonna grab you. I'm gonna pull you out, okay? Okay, I, I'm coming, Joseph. I'm coming, Joseph. Where are you? Okay, I'm coming. Yeah, bro, that's actually scary as mouse. <laughs> that's actually scary, bro. Bro, that's a genuine reaction. What? God damn. Okay, so I heard Joseph's voice, and I thought he wanted me to save him, so I ran outside, and I jumped in the pool to try to save Joseph, and I went under the water, and I saw Joseph, but it wasn't Joseph, it was the monster using Joseph to try to kill me. Right, so just don't go in the pool. What? Don't go in the pool. He can only kill you if you go in the pool, so don't go in the pool. Oh. Huh. Yeah, it's that easy. So if I go in the pool, I die? Yes. Let me tell you this, Junior. If you never go in that pool ever again, this is not even a problem. It's not scary. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I can only die if I go in the pool. Exactly. Don't go in the pool. Exactly, bro. <laughs> Joseph? No, that's the monster trying to lure you into the pool so he can kill you. Oh. Not Joseph. He's already dead because he went in the pool, so don't go yeah, in the pool. Yeah, he's dead. Joseph's voice is so annoying. Yeah, well, you know what's even more annoying? Getting killed in your pool. And you know what else is that annoying? That would be annoying, bro. trash. Help me clean it up. Okay, I'll be clean it up. Jesus, what if we have company? They're gonna think you're a barbarian. Yeah. Hey, Junior, guess which one of these corn dog sticks was in my ass? Which one? <laughs> the one that smells like shit. Which one is that? Sniff around and find out. No. That has residue doo No, 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 no. That one. Okay, good. Now that we cleaned up all that trash and all those doo-doo covered corn dog sticks, why is my ass so dirty? Anyway, now that we're done with that, we can go back to not going in the pool, which is very easy. <laughs> well, what if one day I want to throw a pool party? Well, don't. Do it in a different pool. There are a lot of other pools out there. Just use those. Well, my dad spent a lot of money on that pool, so, like, 
I, mean, I was gonna say, you don't it. have a lot See, of money to have a pill in your garden, bro. Die, because they don't avoid the thing they know kills them. Like in the ring, where there's that tape that kills you if you watch it, just don't watch the fucking tape. That's all you have to do. I mean, just he's speaking sense here. I mean, the tape. it's a very simple thing not to, hey, Junior, not to do. Tell me there's a tape out there that'll kill me if I watch it. Hey, Cody, there's a tape out there that'll kill you if you watch it. Not watching that shit. I don't want to watch that. I don't want to die, so I'm not gonna watch it. See? See how easy that was? Try to hand me the tape. Pretend you're handing me the tape that kills you. Hey, Cody, here's a tape that if you watch it, it kills you. I'm not touching that. I don't want anything to do with that. I don't want that. <laughs> see? See how easy that was? See, see how easy? It's like it's like when you're on Facebook and there's like those covered videos. It's like, oh, it might be bad. Like, don't click on it. I know whatever I'm going to see is going to be bad and it's going to be fucked up and it's going to make me sad, so I'm not going to click on it. It's very easy. Like, see, this, like, this guy's speaking sense. I'm going to die this guy if knows. I look at you. You're going to die if you look at me. Sorry, Junior. Not going to look at you anymore. See how easy that was? Well, you would die right now if you looked at okay, me. Okay, well, that was an example. Do you want me to continue not looking at you? No, 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 no. Listen, can you just Google, like, why my pool would be haunted? Me? Google? Wh why can't you Google it yourself? I'm scared. Everything scared me. I saw a face underwater that tried to kill me. Oh, Bro, that okay. face was actually scary why as well. Why is my pool haunted? Well, it says it might be haunted if somebody died in your pool. <gasps> you think someone drowned in a long time ago and now the ghost is trying to make other people drown? I don't know. That sounds uh, fine. Yeah, sure. Okay, so how would you kill the monster in my pool? I don't know and I don't fucking care. Google, bro. No, seriously, Cody, if there was a monster in your pool, how would you kill it? <sighs> okay, I, I guess I would electrocute it. I would toss a toaster in there. <gasps> If I toss a toaster and it'll kill the monster? Yes, but you would have to get close to the pool, which I specifically told you not to do. I'm gonna go do it. Okay, good luck. Hey, monster. Wanna kill me? How about you make me some toast first? <laughs> Junior, that was so fucking gay. What? Well, what you said. You, you could have said, you're toast, not, why don't you make me some toast? <laughs> the way he died was like, <laughs> Hey, I actually enjoyed that episode. That episode was pretty deep. That was that was up there with one of one of the good ones. I did enjoy that one and that that mask, especially show when he went with the walls though, was pretty damn petrifying, I ain't gonna lie. We ain't beating around the bush on his review here. It's definitely up there. Maybe a 4.6. 4. Point, no, actually. 4.6 would mean 5 stars, so we're going to have to go 4.4, and it's going to keep the 4 star. Great episode. Let me know what you thought in the comment section below, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.